Uh, temperatures will feel a little bit more holiday like for us. 77 degrees right now in Denton. Uh, maybe you like to eat ice cream with cooler weather. I do know some people that like that. Uh, when it gets cold, they're like, I really want ice cream right now. Well, well it's going to cool down just a bit more for tonight. As you take a look, Frisco Sky Cam right now, we're at 77 degrees. Winds out of the west, northwest at 7. Uh, we're going to be seeing temperatures cooling down right now at Clyde Warren Park. We still have temperatures in the upper 70s to the low 80s with winds out of the west, northwest at 6. So the front's just now sliding its way. Through parts of the Metroplex, cooling us down right now in South Lake, 74 degrees, 80 in Benbrook, 79 in Mesquite to 77 in Allen. So this evening, our temperatures continue to cool their way down into the mid 50s by 11 to then 53 degrees by 1, and then we cool down into the low 50s to the upper 40s by tomorrow morning. This forecast, computer models trying to say, eh, mid 50s, I think will be a little bit cooler than that when you wake up tomorrow morning. And then tomorrow, the change will be yes, we have plenty of sunshine. It's going to be a bit more breezy, and we're not going to warm up too much. We're only going to make it up to maybe 70 to 71 degrees tomorrow afternoon with our winds out of the north northwest near about 15 miles per hour holding on. The cold front has already pushed its way through parts of the southern plains. Oklahoma City right now at 69. Well, we're in the low 80s officially at DFW. It's 65 in Wichita to 63 Springfield, Missouri, 71 in Little Rock. So here comes the cooler air, and it's going to settle its way on in. The temperature swings we've been having, we're going to see temperatures Wednesday 75, then Thursday up to 83. Another cold front comes through, and look at Friday, possibly a high of only 57 degrees, and Saturday seeing a high of 60 degrees. So big temperature swings in the seven day forecast. We're going to be seeing high pressure really in charge the next couple of days. And then going into Wednesday afternoon, that area of high pressure shifts its way down to the southeast. Here comes this next cold front, pretty strong for us on Friday, but we're not going to have a lot of moisture return in place to see any rain get really squeezed out on Friday. So I do ex expect a small rain chance. And then on Saturday, that sunshine returns, and we're going to be seeing temperatures trying to warm back up. But 83 Thursday, then a high of only 57 degrees on Friday. Saturday, seeing 60 degrees. So the seven day forecast shows those temperatures continuing to cool their way on down. We have that front. Boundary pushing its way on through. And then take a look at this on Saturday morning, possibly seeing some temperatures in the low 40s, even as we take a look. Yeah, here you go. Well, they're backing up there on me, but I wanted to show you that temperatures possibly in the upper 30s in some spots of North Texas by Saturday morning. Sunday, seeing 68 degrees. Then by Monday, seeing 78 degrees. So, warm up that is on the way. And then for Halloween, it looks like highs in the mid 70s. So, trick or treat time, possibly upper 60s and dry, parents. So, you don't have to worry about covering up the costumes that you've been working on if they've decided yet. All right. Sounds perfect, Scotty. Thank you.